Hello again, Joe here with Prismatic Powders. Today we're going to talk about our anti-gas primer, particularly why and when you want to use this type of primer. Our anti-gas primer is an epoxy primer that will give you the excellent corrosion resistance and the durability that you expect from an epoxy, but this one is special in that it actually eliminates those gas bubbles that typically wreak havoc on your finish when you shoot materials that are prone to gassing, like cast metals. Normally when you shoot cast parts, you would outgas them prior to the powder application. This process will take well over an hour. The part has to come up to temperature, and that temperature is at least 50 degrees above the curing temperature, and then you stay at that temperature for at least 45 minutes, and then it needs to cool. With the anti-gas primer, you simply prep the surface as normal, apply the primer, and then flash it. After that, you let it cool, then you can apply whichever powder you desire on top. We're gonna go down to the booth. We're gonna shoot a cast part that has not gone through the outgassing process to demonstrate the performance of this primer. As I mentioned previously, we have not outgassed this cast piece. We've simply blasted the surface and blown it off with compressed and filtered air. As with all of our primers, spraying the anti-gas primer is very straightforward. We recommend spraying at one and a half to two and a half mils. Once we achieve our approximate mill thickness, we'll place it into the oven at 325 degrees Fahrenheit. Since this part will have a top coat, we don't need to fully cure it. We're just flashing it. After the part has cooled, we'll spray out our top coat, which is going to be Goldtastic. Now with the top coat on, we'll get it into the oven to cure, and we should have a nice, smooth coat with no signs of outgassing when we're done. All right, that's it for today's video. Hopefully it helps explain our anti-gas primer. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.